Hey guys and welcome to another video and in this video today we are going to look at all the gestures that you can use to navigate around your iPad. All you need is an iPad running iPadOS 13 even though some of these gestures might also work on iOS 12. We will also talk about iPad's multitasking options and split view options so if you want to jump to that click on the timestamp in the description below. So let's get started. So what you can do inside any app is that you can swipe from the bottom to access the dock and you can swipe and hold to access the task switcher. So if you have multiple apps open, you can just use your three fingers, change between the apps as you can see over here. So the more you do, you can just switch between the apps. So while you are inside an app, what you can also do is you can use a four pinch finger pinch and hold to access the task switcher again. So this works inside any app, so you take four fingers and use pinch and hold to access the task switcher. If you do a quick pinch, you'll just go back into the home screen. Of course, if you are inside an app, you can always press the home button if your iPad still has it and you can go into the home page. So for the next segment of this video, we'll look at how you can multitask using split view and hovering windows. So for this, we'll first open up an app. Then you can swipe up the dock from below and you can just press and hold on an app and drag it out to create a window like that. So now you can add more apps to the app window. So for that, we'll just swipe up from the bottom and we'll go into the browser and drag that over there. So as you can see, now we have two apps open in this app window. So you can swipe up on the top bar that you can see over there like that to dismiss the window and you can just swipe back from the right to again bring it back. Of course, you can swipe up on this bar to show all the apps open over there and you can quickly switch between those two apps. What you can also do is you can hold the top bar and drag it to the middle of the screen to make that app home page or make that app full screen, I'm sorry. So as you can see, the remaining hovering window is still there. So you can just swipe that out to the right or you can just drag that out to the right to create a split view screen. And you can use the middle bar to drag and select which or the width of each video window or you can just drag it out directly to create a full screen of the app again. So iPadOS now supports opening multiple windows of the same app. So for that we'll just head up and open the notes app and for example we want to open multiple notes to compare our notes or to drag and drop text between the two notes. So what I can do is I can tap and hold on a note and drop it onto the side to create a split view of the two apps. Now as you can see I can see both the windows of the same thing. If, now if you want an additional window you can always drag that up from the top to access the dock, press and hold on the notes app icon and click on show Win all windows. When all that is done, you can just add a new window and a new instance of the note app will also open up. As you can see, if you now go into task view, iPadOS now preserves your multitasking views. So you can just always click on that and head back to the original split view option that you have set up. So you don't need to set this up multiple times if you minimize the app or if you change the apps. So it's all right there. The next thing that we'll look at is how you can copy a text or drag text from one place to the another. So I'll just go over there and select this whole text and I'll just press and hold and drag it and drop it to this note. So that's how you can copy and paste into multiple sections. Say now we want to put a video link of a YouTube video. So what you can do is just drag up and open the YouTube app on one of the screens over there. So I'll just want the link of this video. I'll just hold on that and drop it over there. And as you can see, now I have a link of that YouTube video in that other section. You can also apply this to other sections and you can select multiple items at once. So for this demonstration, we'll just go over and open the Photos app over there. And then we'll just go over and open the Notes app on the side. So as you can see, it has we have opened multiple instances of the same app. So you can select on which window you wish to open. So I'll just go ahead and click on that and keep that Notes open. So say I want to complete or copy multiple images from the photos app. So what I can do is I can select one app and drag it out and I'll just keep this pressed and I can select on more multiple images and as you can see it will collect to the same space. Now I can use this or I can swipe this up and I can drag all these photos into the notes app and they'll just paste right over there. All the photos are here that we have dragged from the photos app to into the notes app. So that's pretty much all the gestures and the multitasking stuff that you can do on your iPad. So I hope you did find this video interesting. Thank you guys once again for watching till the end of this video. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one.